British Grand Prix ticket sales have been temporarily suspended in a blow to fans. F1 fans have attacked British Grand Prix organizers for increasing the prices of F1 tickets and then shutting down the website. Some reported prices rising while they were trying to pay as demand for seats surge.it comes weeks after Silverstone admitted costs would increase based on demand. Twitter user at FLUZZER90 said, So at Silverstone UK 3-day ticket I was looking at when I first tried was from £559. I've been repeatedly kicked out of queues, and now it's from £689. Wow, s way to treat the fans. Hat Jun Khan added, got my tickets luckily, but it's a joke, how you're increasing prices even more during a cost of living crisis. At F-O-R-Z-A-F-E-R-R-A-R-I-7 posted, love for you to explain the justification for prices going up every few minutes, when you and most other circuits would put a percentage rise every few months and be upfront with it. Were you hoping no one would notice at Alan Sabatino commented, what an utter mess you've turned this into. Loyal fans who have been for years are now getting screwed over. Some social media users revealed they had over five hours in an online queue to even get a chance to secure tickets. SKY Sports host David Croft said Silverstone had confirmed there were 25,000 people in the queue yesterday evening. He also revealed 210,000 people had registered early to buy tickets. However, hours later the site was shut down, leaving fans worried they would be unable to secure their place. A statement from Silverstone read, We've decided to suspend the 2023 Formula One British Grand Prix ticket sale, as we're acutely aware a lot of fans have experienced intermittent issues in securing their tickets. Due to ongoing issues with our ticketing provider, Secutix, we feel the fairest thing for us to do is to temporarily pause sales and freeze all ticket prices until these are resolved. We plan to be back on sale at 1130 a.m. today and reassure you, we still have good availability across all ticket types. Please watch our social channels and keep an eye on your emails for our most up-to-date timings. Once again, we sincerely apologize for the frustrating experience that many of you have had today, and thank you for your support throughout this time. Addressing price concerns, David Croft claimed Silverstone had told him prices do not increase automatically. He added organizers had assured him costs only rise after manual checks to try and stop prices spiraling quickly.